Afghan Women's Writing Project is an organization which provides safe spaces in Afghanistan for women to write and share their poems and essays, believing that to tell one's story is a basic human right. This is how we empower future generations. One, two, one, two, three, four. I want to write, wake up this we embarked upon this project because we thought it would be a really cool concept to have girls from one of the most affluent areas on the planet collaborate with girls who are in a much different situation. I chose the poem Little Flowers. I chose it because it was a really powerful poem and it was like, it just spoke to me. Um, the name of the poem is My Struggle. And I chose it because it's about hope and like fighting for your rights and your will. The poem that um, I wrote a song to is called Like a Breeze and I think it's really special because like I got to hear someone else's words writing something that even means something to me. I couldn't think of anything that was more profound than people being told they can't write and doing it anyway and being really defiant in it. I hope that if the writer that um, wrote this poem could hear my song, I hope that she would feel strong and powerful because her words are being heard. I hope that she would feel that I did it justice and that I adequately communicated the message that she was trying to send to know that people are thinking about her so she doesn't feel so alone. Um, I hope it encourage her, encourages her to keep writing. I hope she felt loved. It amazes me how much they care and how just one little spark has really set off a fire in them to make a difference and they are so compelled and just bent on raising money so that girls can write the way that they're able to write here. I feel so blessed to have this opportunity to try and help these women in these spe this special way. They really like made me feel lucky to be in a place where I am. We definitely take stuff for granted. I am able to read and write and do everything and sing and write poetry whenever I want to. I've learned that I just have to appreciate even the little things that I have, like being able to go to school and do homework. They're so strong, so much stronger than I think I could ever be.